Président. In your the association paper in the Canadian Police Association paper on the legalization and recreational use of marijuana, one of your recommendations is for edibles and I guess for even a joint for if I went to the store and bought it to implement maximum maximum levels of THC per serving or per however they want to sell it. That doesn't seem to be clear in the bill. Do you have any recommendations as to how toxic or how strong each serving should be? Uh, I, I will uh, answer shortly to that. Maybe ask Deputy Chief uh, Sir to add any comment. But for, on the edible, we what we understand is that after, uh, let's say, a year after the legalization of cannabis, uh, edible will be dealt with uh, legally. It's still illegal. But if but I go into a store now and I want to buy some to make roll joints, yeah. um, should there be a level of THC? In a maximum plant? level? Yes, a maximum level in the, in the product I'm buying. Well, I'm, um, I'm not a toxicologist, but I, I, what we ask for is that the, all the um, so the labeling be very clear with respect to THC levels and toxicology experts could talk about what the maximum, maximum should be, for example, for a joint with respect to edibles, and we've already seen in other jurisdictions very high levels in small candies and people have serious effects from that. We have to make sure that there are rules around these edibles because they are becoming more and more popular. So we'll have to definitely have rules and a lot of awareness and education to prevent problems. To the uh, answer of uh, Chief Ahel, to the question of Senator uh, Eaton. I, I could just add, the broad concern is, you know, and I, I don't think it's up to the police to determine what those levels of well, I'm just, it's just because it was one of your recommendations. Yeah, because the broad concern is there should be, people should know what they're buying. And from a policing perspective, if, if there's no regulation or, or constraint around uh, levels of uh, toxicity. Uh, toxicity, then it creates another uh, public safety uh, issue. So we, and, and the experience in other, in some of the American states where they've legalized uh, marijuana and edibles are widely available. Well, Initially, think, at least, was. Well, I think Colorado, the, that was one of their recommendations yes. to us, was to okay. establish. Can I have one more fast question? Um, I'm sorry. In a second round, because I okay. still have Senator Sinclair. Time is going by quickly. Senator Sinclair. 